this is Connie, and I'm having an extremely bad hair day, so I have it back. First of all, I went back in the ponytail here, and this here's one to stick straight out, so now I have it in the double ponytail. <laughs> so if you turn, see me when I turn, it looks that way. Well, I am trying a new foundation today. This is a get ready with me, and I've already put on my, my um, primer, and what I used was the Smashbox, one of the many samples I've gotten from Ulta. Um, very silicone -y feeling, but it works well. And I use thought the Born This Way foundation that um, I got several several samples of this, and this is the light color. This is the only one I'm keeping. And this is, it says, undetectable medium to full coverage application. And it's by Too Faced, of course. And look how freaking runny it is. Wow. This is the third time I've tried to start this because every time it runs into something. So anyway, I am going to start. Just going to put a couple drops on my brush and get started. Boy, this looks awful yellow. I'm going to go wash my face and we're going to put on a different foundation because this is ridiculous. If you can see this, how yellow. It makes my skin look. It, I look dead. <laughs> it's terrible. I'll be right okay, back. I'm back. I've washed my face completely and um, put primer on. And I'm using the Magic Lumi Primer by L'Oreal. It's Light Infusing Primer, it's called. And what I've decided I'm going to do is I'm going to use my Lumi Cushion. I haven't used it for a little while, and I love this thing. So I'm going to see if I can get this to work with my brush. I don't know if I can or not. Yeah. So much difference. Using this brush, I'm probably pulling way too much product out, and it's going in. Well, nothing really goes into this brush. I'm just going to show you snippets of my disaster with the uh, Born This Way. <laughs> you know, and that was light. Maybe fair would be different, but um, I'll never find out because because of this disaster, I won't use it again. Okay. See, this goes on flawlessly with these brushes flawlessly. Oh, and what I used was this. Now I got the outside of it really dirty because of my brush, but the Lumi Cushion in W2, which is light, I do believe. Light Ivory. And Fair and Light Ivory are my colors. Those are fine. The other was, the Lumi was in light, or the um, I wish I could see what color this was. Vanilla it was. So maybe it was the vanilla. Isn't that kind of fair? 
I don't know, but it looked awful on my skin. I will never use this again. So I'm throwing this. I mean, it's empty anyway, so I'm throwing that sample away. I'm throwing the Smashbox away, even though the Smashbox worked pretty good. All right, on to my brows. Today I am going to use the e.l.f. Eyebrow Tint and something and tame. I don't use this side. I use this side. It's been a while since I used this. I've only got a couple. I, I rotate all of mine. So I use it and then I put it in a different drawer. And then it has to wait its turn till I get through all of my other ones. And so I've only got one left after this one. I'm going to use this one next week. Maybe. I don't know yet. I'm just so darn flustered with that stupid born this way. And I just love Too Faced stuff, and I thought for sure I would love that. But I hate it. I've never put on a foundation and taken it off before, ever. I'm 60 years old. I've never done that. I just, you know, I've all, I'm not going anywhere. I, I spent... All morning long at my mother's helping her, I vacuumed and I, um, we went to McDonald's or I went and got stuff from McDonald's for lunch and, and stuff like that. And um, just helped her out. And then I, I pulled weeds outside for a while and um, my weeds are getting out of control. Whoops, somebody told me not to put the primer all the way down, and I did. I'm just going to have to live with it today. Because I am not doing anything different again. I just used my Ulta Eye Primer that I use all the time, every time I put on makeup. Okay, for my makeup this week, I am using the NYX Avant, Avant Pop in Nouveau Chic, APSP03, Nouveau Chic. And what the colors look like, so pretty. Um, I, I'm gonna clean my brush off because I did some cleaning on something a little bit ago and I, all right. So this, um, this really doesn't have a base color that is matte. So I will just use this today. I'm, like I said, I'm not going anywhere today. Usually I would, you know, if I'm not happy with the foundation, I would leave it on. But that was too bad. And I hope you could, I really hope you think I wasn't being silly, you know, and you could see it in the in the uh, video how terrible it looked. I have got an itch like you wouldn't believe on my nose. All right, so um, trying to figure out what to use. These are, you know, they're powdery, but um. Not too powdery. Only when I kick it, kick it up. So I've got a few videos to do today. I I wasn't for sure if I would do a lot of videos today, but I think I'm going to do at least two. This one and another one for sure. And I don't know when this video is going up, but um, so the video that I'm talking about might be up before this one, but I'm going to do my giveaway. So in case you haven't seen that, make sure you go and enter. In case you're new to my channel and didn't see that. 
now I've got black stuff in the corner of my eyes. Okay. Clean my brush off. And what am I going to wear on my eyes? I know I've got blue and green on, green on today. But I don't care. I'm going to wear purple today. This is kind of step out of my box today. Oh, that's pretty. I do want it a little darker than that, though. I do love this palette. And I try to rotate my palettes, too, so um, I haven't used this one for a while. I'm going to have to clean my eye off because I got powdery. Okay, let me grab this. I use this every once in a while if I goof. I want to wipe my foundation off. just want to kind of wipe. Yeah, it's a little powdery. I've got powder underneath my eyes. But I am not real good at bouncing my brush here. <laughs> so that's why. Okay, so I'm going to use just a touch of this stuff in the center of my eye. show you what I used here in a second. All right. What I used was this as my base. I know it's a little shimmery, but oh well. I used this as my transition or crease color. I used this as my eyeshadow, and I used this in the center of my eye, this gold. Isn't that beautiful, that palette? Just gorgeous. And this is what it looks like. All right. And I'm going to use my Physician's Formula Shimmer Strips in... This is the nude eyes, and this is very black, I do believe. And it's just the little thing that goes up. I'm going to use that a little bit. on. I was going to go a little lighter on this today. Just in my waterline. This is one that goes on your waterline. So nice. Never fails. As soon as I pull my eye up, then I got a blank. Ah! I don't want my eyes to water. Should do the top first, actually. <laughs> All right, so now I am going to go in with, this is one that I've had for quite a while, and I, I don't know why I don't use it. Somebody gave me this. Um, one of my friends here in town, actually, gave this to me because we were talking, and this was when I first started at the bar, like in June, and she was, we were talking about makeup, and she said she's got, um, two of those and would I like one and I said heck yes I don't have anything by right. Bobby Brown next mascara 
no, I just used mascara. I'm going to use my MAC blush, and this is in At Dusk. Oops, if you open it the right direction. Looking in my mirrors here. And for my highlighter, oh darn it. Got a hair here. I am going to use the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Illuminating Palette in Catwalk Pink. And what this looks like, it is absolutely beautiful. I won this in a giveaway. Okay, looks like that. And I use the lighter side. And it's kicking up some powder. But oh my god, it's gorgeous. Yeah, it's pretty powdery, but it's gorgeous. All right, for lipstick. Almost done, guys. I am going to use my NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick in... LSC L03 drives me nuts when they don't they can't even bother be bothered to name their damn lipsticks sorry but anyway it is a gorgeous deep kind of burgundy color let's see if I can do this without really messing it up because it looks really red Okay, guys, there you have it. Beautiful, beautiful color, but as messy as I am with lipstick, it uh, it's a good thing you can't see me really up close. <laughs> so anyway, I've just noticed that my face looks really, really round when I have my hair pulled back, <laughs> which it is really round, but... I'll talk to you later. If you like this kind of thing, please give me a thumbs up if you like it. And share the video. That would be awesome. Talk to you later. Bye.